All right, folks, we're stripping the interior. We'll get it all taken apart, door panels, seats, carpet, kick panels, sill plates, door seals, all of it's coming out. We're gonna, we're gonna wire wheel the floor all down and Ospo it. And prime and paint it. Put dynamite on it, we got the trunk all emptied out. I didn't put the filler neck back in the gas tank so that it'll be out of the way. I'll get that vent line out of there. The trunk's pretty much stripped. We got the head mechanic pulling all the armrests. Door handles, I'll get the door panels off. We've ordered new door seals with the uh, wind lace, carpet, sun visors, new cards for the doors because the, the door panels, the, uh, you can see here, the cards are all warped and broken. We got new ones. We'll restretch that vinyl with some heat gun, glue, and staple it on. I've done it before, it comes out pretty good. We'll repaint the dash and the front of the dash and the top of the doors where the paint's all off of them. And we're gonna paint the door jams. So we got our work cut out for the next week or so. See what happens. Say hello. Hello. All right, we'll be back. What? You got it on? Go ahead. Go ahead, get in. Crank it up, always listen to me. What? Listen. Just try and knock down try and not knock down the house, okay? Okay. Alright, baby. Have fun. Okay. taking her Uncle John's race car out for a spin.
I can drive better backwards than I can forwards, and I can drive pretty damn good forwards. I think it had to do something with the teacher. No, she didn't. All right, we're getting there. The uh, head mechanic says you're going for an airplane ride. There she goes. And the shop apprentice has figured out that this is a whole lot more fun than working. So, I don't know if we're going to get any more out of her today. Whoa! Still on? Yes. That's what happens when an old fat cripple man trips. <laughs> All right. We're going to put these seats away in a safe place inside the uh, redneck motorhome. All right, well, we're gonna see if we can get the front one out now. We'll be back. I'm not so sure I like these people who put these speakers in this car. I see. What are you doing there, kid? Taking these speakers out. You got a thing against music? No. I have a thing against the people who put these speakers in this car. But with the four inch long screws? Yes. Cut the holes in the package shelf. Yes. Don't worry, we got a new package shelf in the dining room. Everybody has a new package shelf in the dining room, don't they? Mm, probably not. No? Hmm. And here I thought I was normal. <laughs> All right, we'll be back. Dude, old man tripped earlier, and like an injured whale, he has beached himself. Better call SeaWorld. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm bolting the front seat. Trying to. I'm trying to keep from breaking these bolts off. Tighten them up, loosen them up. What are you doing? Watching you. Oh, you got nothing better to do than that? Oh, I got plenty to do. All right. All right, what's your daughter doing? She is still racing the race car. Not your normal activity for a 11 year old girl. Not? I never was an 11 year old girl, so I don't know. Let's see. 11 year old girl, I was putting go karts for church signs. Yes. Driving farm birds. Probably getting pretty close to being done, but I thought we were talking about working on the car. We are. I was asking you if you're done taking that seat out. Oh yet. no, I thought you meant done being here. <sighs> no, I'm not done yet. <laughs> the bolt's four miles long and super rusty. 
All right, we'll be back later. Yep. There's a shop foreman. He's not paying any attention to us. I said, there's a shop foreman. There's a shop assistant. There's a head mechanic. Mechanican. I don't know what my job is. I think I'm here to hold this chair down. Is that right? No. No? You were taking a break. Oh, I'm taking a break. I think most everything's broken. You want me to break the rest of it? No. Please don't. <laughs> Get it? Love it? Yeah, she got it. All right, we're still working. We'll let you know when we're done. Or not. Well, looks like our head mechanic has success. She's just like the rice. She got all the carpet out of here. All the threshold plates. We're gonna, we gotta get the back package tray out still. Get the rest of these plugs out of the floor. Shop back out here. And then we're gonna commence to taking the wire wheel to it. Get it all cleaned up. Osbod. Primed. We'll see how far we can get today. You getting tired there, champ? No, it's just a little hot. Hot. Yeah, it's hot. That's what happens when you work in a shade tree shop. Yay. And the shop apprentice, as you can hear, should be coming by. I think she's put about a hundred miles on the race car. That's good, she's having fun. That's what kids are supposed to do. Alright, we'll be back. Knocked up a whole lot of Arkansas dirt there, girl. Little car picked it up to south. Cut worms in Arkansas. Florida's look surprisingly well in this thing. I don't believe there's one hole 